Well, you know, I always enjoy sharing a little bit of good coffee and a little bit of good word with y'all. My good coffee, I've got my uh, Southern Roots. Uh, this is their Lake View. That's uh, Papua New Guinea sourced beans there. To me, that's that, that's the absolute best that they do. That's my all-time favorite from Southern Roots. Mm. Oh, good job there. Pastor Bubba, Pastor Bubba Warren over there, Southern Roots here in Alexandria. Like I said, I'll, I'll put a link to them in the comments down there where you can order some. Now, how about the good word this morning? Now, the good word this morning, I've got, uh, it's been on my mind for a week now. It was a week ago this morning that I woke up with Lamentations 3, 22, 23, going over and over and over in my head. And the steadfast love of the Lord never ceases. His mercies never come to an end. They are new every morning. Great is your faithfulness. You know, you think I got it stuck in my head. Great is thy faithfulness. Great is thy faithfulness. A wonderful song. But instead, I just, uh, instead of just that opening line, all I could just go over and over again was it was, it was just to be able to proclaim morning by morning new mercies I see. Oh, man, I, I hold to that. Morning by morning, new mercies I see. Well, this morning, I woke up singing over and over again. Oh, what a beautiful morning. Oh, what a beautiful day. I got a beautiful feeling. Everything's going my way. <laughs> of course, that's from the musical Oklahoma. I don't know if we're going to sing that in church Sunday, but oh, what a beautiful morning. Oh, what a beautiful day. You know what? God's got some promises for us. I, I definitely believe that. It says that the steadfast love of the Lord never ceases. His mercies never cease. It's new every morning, every day. You know, we're starting tomorrow morning, 40 days of a, of a fast. Now, some people are fasting one meal, two meals, three meals during the day. You cut out snacks. Some are uh, fasting coffee, social media, sugar. I've heard of a bunch of different things. Some are going all in and plan to do a 40-day water-only fast. Um, you know, and, and you can say, well, does that include coffee? Well, you need to pray to God and see what, what He leads you to do. Look, if, if you don't hear from God that you need to participate in this fast, then it, it's not going to succeed. Uh, it's, just, it's just straight up. It needs to be something that God has laid upon your heart. But pray and ask that God, is this, is this something I should do? And if so, then there should be some intentionality. Ask God, God, what am, I, what am I looking for on the other side of this 40 days? What is it that you're looking to change? Remember, a fast isn't to change or move or bend to God. Instead, it's to change and move and bend our knee. Uh, whatever you're fasting, whatever you're giving up, replace that time with a time of um, prayer and a time of getting into God's Word. And it's it's really it's kind of a, a time of rest to be able to see what God has for you. To, you're going to be able to see with clarity if you take your eyes off of everything else going on and you begin to focus more on God. You get to recognize and see the beautiful morning that He has for us, the beautiful day that He has laid ahead for us. That's what God wants in a time that he's called for us, just to set aside a time just to focus on him. Oh, what a beautiful morning. Oh, what a beautiful day. So, look, if you're going to participate, let me know. I've had a few people that have let me know, and every, every morning I'm going to try and send a little individual messages, not group text. I can't stand group text. <laughs> Oh, don't get me started. I'm going to send you a little bit of encouragement to, to kind of get through the day. And I'm going to be honest and open and give you the, the things that I'm facing. What I'm seeing is I'm going through the 40-day fast as well. So send me a message. There should be a message button somewhere. I don't know. you got some fancy way to do something. Drop it in the comments even if you need whatever you need. Let me know because I want to be there for you. And I want you to be there for me as well. Look, let's go into the Lord in prayer right now. Father God, I pray even now for those who are considering to go into the fast, that you would begin to reveal to them those purposes for the fast and their individual purposes. Lord God, lay upon their heart those things to be able to give up, and then more importantly, those things for them to be able to seek during this time. I pray you would give us all the sustaining power, Father. Uh, new mercy every morning as we go into this task. Let us see the beautiful day that you have uh, ahead for us. Father God, I ask all these things in Jesus' name. Amen. 
Look, you know I love you. You know God loves you. Get out there and make sure someone knows you love them as well. And you have a blessed and wonderful day. And I'll see y'all tomorrow.